Hello guys, I was wondering what my Yorkies did when I was away, so I decided to record them. Mm. <laughs> okay, so I am about to go, I'm walking out the door to see one of my Yorkies follow me. Her name is Queen, and the other one that goes to the door, his name is Roberto. They look kind of sad, but I don't know exactly how sad they're going to be while I'm gone. I was curious to figure out, first of all, how my pillows got on the floor, and what exactly do they do when I'm gone? So I'm looking, Roberto like, He's just sitting there by the door, and she goes over. She's pretty smart. Queen goes over to the window. She's looking out the window. She's waiting for me to come back, and I'm not coming back. She kind of panicking now. <laughs> she looks out the window for me, and I'm feeling so sad. My baby misses me already. I've only been gone like one one minute but she's looking out the window and she's really sad meanwhile roberto you can't see him that well but he's over there sitting by the door that i just walked out of he put his head down and he's so sad and he looking like hey she ain't coming back no time soon <laughs> but of course, Queen don't know that I won't be back for another hour, so. But Roberto trying to warn him. She's trying to warn him. I'm not coming back for at least an hour. And he noticed. So she's still kind of panicking. She's at the door. <laughs> oh. Poor mommy. Look at her. She's all sad. She's still looking at the window. She look over at Roberto like, no, she ain't came back yet. Like, you sure? He like, yeah, I'm sure. She ain't came back yet. So, look at Queen. She jumps up in the couch. She look out the window. Roberto looking at her like, hmm, there's no hope. You might as well come down, Queen. She won't be back for another hour. And Roberto look over to the side. And he's sad. He's really, really, really sad. She's still looking out the window. Where are you? <laughs> at this point, I'm like, I'm feeling really bad at the moment. Because I didn't left her all by herself. And I can see that my dogs are really attached to me. I mean... Queen love me, but I think Roberto is the most faithful. He looking over like, she gone. What you doing? <laughs> She's still looking out the window. Poor mommy. I don't know what she thinking. But what I want to know is, how did my pillows get on the floor? Who knocked my pillows down? Hmm. My first instinct will tell me that Queen definitely has something to do with it. But Roberto, mm, he never knocked my pillow down. As long as I have Roberto, he never knocked my pillows down. And Queen is new to our family. So I'm thinking maybe Queen knocked that pillow down. But as you can see, she's sad. She pretty much just give up. Sit down. Berto looking over at her like, it's lost hope, dude. You're wasting your time. <laughs> I say about 20 minutes then went by. She's still looking out the window. You can't see Roberto, but he's still sitting over there by the door waiting on for me to come home. He's out of view, but he's still at that door. And it's been like 20 minutes. If I tell you that. Your dogs will be faithful 
and love and miss you when you're gone. Because Roberto misses me so much. I was curious to see would he ever leave that door. Because he had been at that door now for almost 20 minutes. As you see him, he's still there. <laughs> he put his head down. He's so sad. Oh, my boy so sad. Look at her. She's still at this point. 30 minutes went by. She's still looking for me. <laughs> Roberto like, no, she ain't came back yet. She looking around. Looking around. Look at her. <laughs> she go back to the door. I feel so bad. <laughs> Queen go right back to the window. She starts to look out the window again for me. I'm sorry my dogs are barking in the background. <laughs> As I'm telling you guys this story, she pretty much, I think, Queen gives up at this point. She look over at the window one more time, but I think at this point she has completely given up. Poor thing. And I'm thinking, well, maybe she'll go to sleep. Because... You know, she been like at that window, like I didn't put all the footage on, but she went to that window at least 20 times looking for me. Alberto kind of smart though. He pretty much know like when I come to that door, I'm back. But I think with her, she's like, thinking I'll come back soon or at any moment. I guess she like a in the moment. Wait a minute, Roberto's getting up. Hmm. Oh. So he's not that faithful. <laughs> hmm. That kind of makes me sad. I kind of wanted him to stay at that door and wait for me. But that's kind of selfish of me. But I don't know. Roberto kind of over all of this. And I'm thinking maybe he'll play with her or, you know, maybe she'll play with him. But they pretty much have distanced themselves from each other. And Roberto just lay down. I guess he was tired of laying on that hard floor. And she pretty much like, you just going to lay there? Mommy's gone. You're going to lay there? You're going to lay there and just be a lazy old dog? <laughs> she's like off <laughs> she's still sitting there she's not sleepy but she's waiting for me to come back I love her so much she has this beautiful silky long straight hair I guess at this point she kind of gets tired she just lay her hair there she's just laying there Oh. Oh, wait a minute. I think maybe she heard something. <laughs> well, she's not just going to lay there. Roberto is. He know where. What? <laughs> she going to lay on side of him. He like, get away from me, lady. Get away from me. <laughs> he like her a lot, but <laughs> I don't know how close they're going to get. And I'm hoping they get really close. I guess queen like I'm so over this <laughs> she leave well, she come right back Alberto went right back to the door and she goes over to the door and I'm sure she don't hear anything because I'm still not there and of course she goes to the window looking for me <laughs> she want me so bad to come home and just rub her belly but I feel so bad because when I get home, guys, keep watching. You'll see what I do when I come home. <laughs> so, yeah, she's still looking out the window. <laughs> oh, she's like, oh, I'm just going to sit here and have a seat. You can't see Roberto over by the door, but Roberto has been at that door for like 45 minutes now. I think he is the most faithful because he will not leave that door. Oh, she goes back to the door. 
Roberto is still at the door, but you can't see him. He's out of view right now. And of course, she looks out the window. Where is this lady at? I know she's so sad. <laughs> Hopefully, they'll play while I'm gone. Because I was hoping when I got Roberto, her as a new companion, I would think that they would play together. But I don't know. Let's just watch this video. Let's just look at this video and see. Oh, wait a minute. Roberto looked like he's about to play with her. Giving himself a good old stretch. Like, hey, want to play? I guess she was like, no. <laughs> so Roberto just sit there. And he's sitting so funny. Like, why is Roberto sitting like that? <laughs> I never saw a dog sit like that. It's like, it was kind of weird to me. But, yeah. Just sitting all weird looking. And I know she like, why is he right here sitting like that next to me? And I'm thinking that maybe at any moment, maybe they'll play together. Roberto is like two and she's about to be two. So they're about to be well Roberto is grown and she's about to become grown. But yeah, they act like two old freaking dogs. Roberto looking over at the camera. He's like, wait a minute. There's somebody looking out that hole at me. I swear he can see that camera. <laughs> He's like, hey, what, what? I know somebody looking out that hole. That was so weird when I saw him do that. I'm like, do he know that I'm recording him? <laughs> she look over too like, hey, what's going on? Of course, she's looking back out the window again. Poor little thingy. I'm surprised Roberto not sleep because all he like to do is just sleep all day. Well, I spoke too soon. Look like he about to drift off. He look really sad. And at this point, I'm hearing my motion detector go off every 10 minutes on my phone because I have it set up and I should have turned it off. But I know they was doing something. I'm like, I cannot wait to see this video so I can see what my dogs do when I'm gone. Like, what do they do? And at this point, I'm over it. I'm like, they don't do nothing. Like... Oh, wait a minute. There's my small Yorkie. That's Caliente. Caliente is called Caliente for a reason. She is a little hot mamacita. You can see her sitting here fighting queen. Look at them. They're going at it. And I was thinking, who knocked my pillow over? Hmm. I'm thinking, okay. Well, maybe... Queen gonna knock my pillow over because she's mighty close. First, I want to blame it on Roberto, but I'm like, no. As I'm watching this video, I see what's going on. They playing with each other. And somebody's gonna knock that pillow over. But I have no idea. <gasps> ah! Ah! Now, would you believe? <laughs> Caliente. She know. Look at her. She takes off. She knows she shouldn't have did that. <laughs> so the second pillow, Caliente. The second pillow goes down. And you see who does it? And look at Roberto. He's like, ooh, y'all going to get in trouble when she come home. <laughs> Roberto don't want no part in that. Because he know I'm going to be so angry. <laughs> Mm. So, you know, even though they're playing, Queen like, hey, don't distract me from what my test is. I'm trying to find out if my, if my owner is coming home. <laughs> so, that's me walking through the door. And I go through the door and I'm so scared they're going to run out. <laughs> and I walk right past them. Because <laughs> I'm scared they're going to run out the door. <laughs> 
there thank you guys for looking at my video and don't forget to like and subscribe i will see you later